Salman threat letter news break now is getting bigger and bigger and murkier now. There's a statement from Maharashtra Home Ministry. Maharashtra Home Minister says a gang wanted to extort money. He also says that big businessmen, actors were on target. The Maharashtra government says there's now a hunt to all to nab all the culprits. That is the big story that is coming in. Remember, on the back of the threat letter that was received by Salman Khan, the Home Ministry has now issued a statement. Uh, and the Home Ministry has come out with these startling revelations that were breaking first here on India today about how there was a gang that wanted to extort money and top businessmen and actors are now on target. अपना एक रुआब बनाने के लिए ये गैंग ने जो बिशनर गैंग है ये गैंग ने इसमें इसका एक फायदा लेने की कोशिश की है कुछ लोगों को अरेस्ट किया गया है लेकिन अभी तक इसके बारे में सारी इनफॉरमेशन या इस सारी बातें सामने नहीं आई हैं पुलिस इसकी जांच कर रही है और कुछ दिन लगेंगे और कुछ दिन के बाद इसके बारे में सारी स्पष्टता होगी और देव कोटक इज नाउ जॉइनिंग अस लाइव देव मेनी क्वेश्चंस कम अप नाउ नाउ द गैंग दैट वांटेड टू एक्सटॉर्ट मनी अकॉर्डिंग टू द महाराष्ट्र होम मिनिस्ट्री वाज इट लॉरेंस बिश्नोईज गैंग और वाज देयर एनी अदर गैंग इन्वॉल्व दैट इज नाउ टारगेटिंग टॉप एक्टर्स एंड बिजनेसमैन इन मुंबई Uh, so, as per uh, reports, we are getting into also know that a person named uh, Santosh Jadav has been arrested. Uh, he is in the uh, police custody at the moment. The police are going to probe and uh, several more investigation details will come out later. And as the case gets murkier, uh, of course, as we know that the threat letter has also uh, been found uh, and the police have managed to retrieve it. They are in possession of that very chit that was found on the bench at the, uh, you know, at the Bandra bandstand promenade where uh, uh, Salman Khan's father generally goes for a walk. The 86-year-old veteran had handed over the chit to his bodyguards who reached out uh, uh, to the Bandra police station and that's how crime branch got involved. But for the moment, the state home minister Dilip Walse Patil has said that, uh, like I mentioned, that Santosh Jadav is, is, is in police custody. So more details are coming out. But uh, for the timing, Santosh Jadav has also revealed to the cops that they were doing this only to stay relevant and ensure more publicity for the gang. And uh, the only reason why they did it and uh, targeted such a high-profile uh, lyricist, the 86-year-old Salim Khan and also his son Salman Khan, uh, you know, a bigwig in in Bollywood is only to raise doubts, uh, fears and concerns in the mind of people whether the big people, the influential businessmen and the industrialists are safe in the city of Mumbai in, in, in the commercial capital of India. So that is the main idea and as for now this has only emerged that their idea was only to extort money from them by instilling fear and they thought that Salman Khan would be the best template to start from. And if right.